Hello and greetings. Maria Eves coming to you from my home office here in Rotorua, New Zealand. Now that's mariaeves.com. Now today I'm going to go over how we're going to go about uh, installing uh, a privacy policy. Now you can see that I'm actually looking at my blog at the moment. So just at the top here I've got a privacy policy in place and I'm going to show you how to go about installing that for your WordPress. So what we need to do is go into the back of the uh, WordPress and go to plugins and that's down the sidebar of your WordPress dashboard just down the side here and click on that and then what we need to do is add a new plugin so click on the add new and I've actually already installed it but I'll just go through the process and show you how now we're going to call it the easy privacy policy so just type that into the little box there and search the plugins and uh, once you have searched for it we're then able to uh, install it. So you can already see that I've already installed it. So just go ahead and click it and install it. Now the Easy Privacy Policy is an all-in-one solution for making sure that your blog has an AdSense compliant privacy policy that is easy to set up as well as quick to tailor to your specific requirements not covered by the default templates. So in fact, it's so easy, once it's activated, you are only a couple of clicks away from a privacy policy for your site. So let's go and have a look at it. So once you've clicked on plugins, you're back on your main page here, and you'll see it just down the side here, easy privacy policy. Now, we need to go into the settings on the left-hand side, and um, go and do some configuration in there. So in the settings here, what we're going to do is click on the Easy Privacy Policy in the box here on the left here. Now you, you need to put your blog name in the, in the first box right there. Uh, put your email address in the box there. Uh, the page URL is the privacy-policy and the page title is the privacy policy so just make sure those are typed up in the box there you're going to just see as you scroll down to the left there there's about one, two, three, four, five, six different sections in there now I've got them all turned on uh, you will learn as you go but uh, there's already something typed in each of those boxes there and you can adjust it to what you want in there so I'm just going to scroll down basically I really didn't change too much uh, of anything in there and if I have um, I think it was just my email, I can't quite see it at the moment. But what we need to do is make sure that the two buttons are on at the bottom for the options, include a last updated date stamp and also include a credit link for the Easy Privacy plugin. Now you can leave those on if you want to, we'll leave them off, but uh, I've left them on and uh, click the update privacy page. So once you've gone ahead and done that, we can actually go back out to the dash and um, have a look at the actual page itself. So I'm just going to go at the front of my blog and uh, click on Privacy Policy because it'll automatically uh, install that. And uh, what I'm going to do is, uh, you would have read it before you actually updated it. So this is basically how it turns out. And um, you can go ahead and read everything, which you would have done before you actually included in there but that's how you install a privacy policy for your WordPress hosted blog.